Good afternoon, adventurers. It is a lovely day here in Houston, Texas. Today we're going to be checking out the Houston Space Center, okay. and I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, I don't know if you can see, but there's already a huge yeah. freaking Check that out. spaceship in the background. That's sweet. Let's go inside. history back in 1969 with the very first moon landing. I don't know if you can really tell the scale, but this is absolutely huge. So this is the Saturn rocket, and apparently it was supposed to take the astronauts to the moon, but they ended up canceling the mission before it ever flew. So now it's just kind of sitting here for us to check out. It is absolutely magnificent, though. So I think Matt's pretty blown away. <laughs> this is something to behold. Be an astronaut now? Yeah, I want to go to space. I think a career change is due for us. The Endless Adventure, Deep Space. <laughs> This is crazy. I had no idea that this is how you sleep in space. You just hang attached to the wall in this thing. Look at that guy. That's crazy. Does it look comfortable or does it look not comfortable? I'm not sure. In that environment, it's probably the most comfortable you can be. have fun at the Space Center? Yes. That was amazing. Yeah, that was an amazing time. So much cooler than I thought it would be. Yeah, I was a little nervous when we walked in. It looked super gimmicky and like kind of half-assed, but the tram tour is where it's at if you go. Yeah, we did the tram tour and they took us around the facility, so we got to see people actually working on projects at NASA. Yes. We went into the mock-up center and that place was amazing because you could see everything that they were working on and they had like full-scale mock-up of the International Space Station. And then we got to see the Saturn rocket up close and personal. And that was probably the highlight of the tour for me. Allison's feeling a little queasy after all that oh spinning. Oh yes, yeah, I get pretty motion sick, but it was worth it. It's worth it. This is really cool. So they're 
they have a little box in there that runs a fiber optic wire to each one of the bulbs and that's how they send the light through. That's why you can see all these little wires glowing on the ground. Pizza. I think Matt's crashing out for the night. You ready for bed? Mm -hmm. Huh? You ready for bed? Tickle, tickle, tickle. Tickle, tickle. Little baby. Ah! This boy's ready for bed. I think we're ready for bed too. We've been working for like the last three hours. I'll never go to bed. <laughs> She's gonna work forever. I'm gonna sit here and work forever. What was that? There are any monsters outside there. There's something going on out there. It's a bunch of weird noises. Someone's causing a ruckus. Well, at any rate, we're gonna watch It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. And if you have never seen that show, you should because it's freaking awesome. It is a bunch of horrible people doing horrible things and it's amazing. Yeah, they're horrible just like us. Yeah. I think that's why we like the show, because we were late. But after that, we're going to call it a night. Tomorrow, what are we night. doing tomorrow? Oh, we're going back to Austin. Oh, yeah, we're going back to Austin, which is one of our favorite places. Yeah. But it's going to be it's gonna be interesting. We have Allison yeah. has a lot of wedding shenanigans. If you saw the previous vlogs, you might have heard us mention it, but she's the maid of honor in her best friend's wedding. So we have to go back there and sort out a bunch of stuff for that, and we're going to be separated for a little bit when she's doing the bachelorette party and stuff. But... So I'll, I'll be vlogging separately, slash yeah. kind of for the first time. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> I have faith in her. But that is all for tonight. We are hitting the hay hard. Oh, hard. Yeah. All right, good night, adventurers. We'll see you on the road.